welcome back. As the community struggled to cope with the catastrophic loss, detectives scrambled to understand the events leading up to the murders to find a motive. Here, the early investigation and how it led detectives to Preston Strong. We are asking for help. This is the most serious uh, crime that we've had. With the community still in shock and in the midst of grieving. I, I just went crazy when I, when I found out that they were all dead. Police detectives scrambled to piece together the clues, looking for a motive and a suspect. We're considering all options and all potential motives. All things go through your head. You don't know what, who to believe, what to believe, you know. Police looked at ties into the mafia, drug cartels, money laundering, and even Luis Rios' ex-wife. I told her that there was just a lot of people that felt she was probably involved in this somehow. The one thing I can tell you is she never changed. She talked to us anytime we wanted to talk to her. She, she did anything we asked. I had nothing to hide, you know. Um, I was there to maybe help. It was several months before police would zero in on the man who would ultimately become their prime suspect. Preston Strong. After all, he was Luis Rios's best friend. A friend and co-worker of Luis Rios who did not want to be on camera remembers his good friend. He was a nice, caring, loving guy. Um, he'd do anything for anybody. Very honest and very giving. He just a tremendous person all around. You know, it just was devastated because, you know, he was one of the pallbearers, you know, to my husband's Yes. But the investigation had a major leap when two years later in 2007, Yuma Dr. Satinder Gill was murdered and the evidence pointed to Preston Strong as a suspect in that case as well. Adriano Ozuna came forward on that case and advised investigators at a crime scene the night that he was discovered that she believed he might have been involved. Adriano Ozuna was Strong's girlfriend. She also worked for Dr. Gill. She later told me when he was arrested for that murder that she could not believe he was being caged like an animal. It can't be both ways. 911, what is your emergency? Somebody on the street before me. I think there was gunshot fired. Okay, how many? Um, about four or five. Okay, did you see anyone? No, and somebody was yelling, help, help, help. Uh, give, me, give me the vehicle. Oh, no, no, no. When we return, the trial, the witnesses, and the verdict, what this means for the family.